Well, hello, scanner enthusiasts. This is the SDS 200 Uninins 2019 base station scanner. It does excellent decoding of the simulcast systems on P25. Now, what we're going to do is I want to show you a really cool feature, which is the analyze. Now, I run a bunch of antennas, so I'm constantly trying to figure out what antenna configuration is going to work the best. So if we um, look at one of my uh, locations here, let's uh, lower right hand button, brings you to the menu. What we're going to do is we're going to come up to analyze. Just click that again so you can get to this screen. You don't have to type anything in, you just go ahead and click again, and that will bring you to your systems. Now if I want to see a system that I know I get a pretty good signal on, we will go to Mesa. This is their simulcast location. And I believe this is <clears throat> the signal strength, decode, and activity. As you can see, the signal strength comes and goes, but it's fairly, fairly good. Decode is up there, and the activity. Um, Mesa, of course, is a very busy department, so you'll see a lot of activity. Uh, the decode, when on other scanners you may hear a little garble, it's because it's not decoding well. This is this is decoding well, and let's look at a different location that I don't get so well out here in Mesa, but I get it good enough, just not really great. And then again, I'll be hooking up another antenna and testing different antennas to see the uh, signal strength. So, system, click again. Let's go down to Phoenix. I get Thompson Peak very well, but I don't get this one so good. So click on Simulcast A. You see the strength is a little low. Because the strength is low, decode is still going to suffer a little. And you see Phoenix has always got a lot of activity. Now I can try different antennas. Right now it's hooked up to an uh, outside one. So let's go ahead and put the antenna that comes with the scanner. See what kind of signal change we get. So I'm going to unplug the antenna right there. You see the signal goes down to nothing. And if I will drop this antenna. Let's plug the stock antenna in there. And sometimes you might get a better signal. So here's the stock antenna, completely collapsed, right? Now if we start to raise it slightly, do we get a better signal? I'm going to raise it up just a little bit. Nope. Oh, signal is pretty much the same. Yep. So this is a hard sight to get. If I take that antenna all the way up, Still not going to make much of a difference. Now I have a, another inside antenna that is specifically tuned to 800 megahertz. So let's plug that one in. See how that one looks as it falls. So this is an actual Motorola one here. I'll hold that one up. I'll just hold it up here. And you see not really much change with that signal. That's actually not, not too bad. A little bit better. So what, what uh, happens is someone puts out there that I got a long antenna, I got a big antenna, I got a high antenna. That's the way to go. And what it really is, is your antenna tuned? Is it the right length for the band? Not only that, but is, is your cable right? Are you having a decimal loss? Or is it a long cable? If it's over 50 feet and you're at 800 megahertz, you're going to want to get a better quality uh, cable with a lot less loss on it. But uh, that's just a cool little function I really 
really really like in this scanner and allows me to uh, tune it a little bit better than it or tune it the best that I can so hope you found this video helpful and uh, leave comments let's have a discussion All right.